So, okay. So guys, um, as we were talking in the last part of the video, um, we are discussing a little bit about holidays. And a lot of these are actually U.S. holidays. Okay, U.S. holidays. But there are also Dominican holidays. Which one of these are also Dominican holidays? The New and Year. New Year, yes, that's a Dominican holiday as well. What about Valentine's, Valentine's Day? Day? Very good. So one, um, two. Father's Day. And Father 20, and Mother's Day. Very good. 20, Happy Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day. Halloween. Halloween is a Dominican what? holiday now. It's kind oh. of yeah. Hot, Holy Week. Me Holy too. Week. Easter, right? So Easter. Okay. Easter. Then, yes. Uh, 27th of February. Yes, but it's not here. 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 Oh, okay. Yes. Thanksgiving? Christmas. Christmas. Okay. So Christmas. So we have five. Fourth of July is yeah. not. Memorial Day is not a Dominican holiday. Father and Mother say it's not. Oh, yeah, it is. Sorry, it is. Easter, it is. So, yes, about five of these holidays are also Dominican holidays. I celebrate this, I'm sorry, seven, uh, 27 uh, of February. Uh, yeah. Yes, but it, I am talking about the images here, here here okay okay yes the image is here very good now guys let's 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 do this uh we are going to share we share the following holidays new year's eve and day we share that holiday with the united states as we saw we also share valentine's day we share easter we share christmas and we share mother and father's day same month, but different day, okay? The American Mother's Day is different than the Dominican Mother's Day. Because the Dominican Mother's Day is the first, first Sunday, no, right? the no? last Sunday of May. And I the think last. the American is the first Sunday of May. Yes. Something like that. Very good. Well, you guys know more than I do about this topic. All right. So... In the Dominican Republic, we celebrate religious, meaning only. Okay, in the DR, we celebrate the religious, meaning only. In the US, they celebrate Easter, Easter Bunny, as, as Wanda was saying, which they hunt for chocolate eggs. Yes, Wanda, do you remember you said, are those eggs? Yes. Yes, they are eggs. Very good. But in the DR, it's only a religious celebration now in the u.s they share gifts with each other for christmas we don't do that in in the dominican republic right no it's not very common some people do but not everybody we my family does but we are dominican american so it's a little bit different in dominican republic the 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 day king's before. day oh yes but also for gifts King's Days. Yeah. King's Day for gifts, presents. But yes, uh, that day we call the day before, so December 24th, December 24th, we in English is called Christmas Eve. Christmas Eve, okay? In Spanish is good night, but in English is Christmas Eve. Okay, so Mother's Day and Father's Day in the U.S., Mother's Day becomes in, 19, 19, in 1914, Mother's Day becomes an official recognized day. But in 1972, Father's Day gains the same status. So as you see, we fathers, nobody likes, nobody likes us, only oh mothers. God. Is that true, Paola? Nobody likes fathers. Yeah, only mother. Only mother. Look, father. That's like more than 50 years. 50 years later, later, 
We have a Father's Day. Oh my goodness. One is more flexible with the mother. Yes, that is true. All right, so these are particular days to the US, meaning that only in the United States these days are celebrated. Veterans Day, Veterans Day, which is November 11 for honoring military veterans who are people who have served in the United States Army. Okay, this is, there's a mistake here. It's Army, the United States Army. That's one day that is different. Now, another day that is only celebrated in the US is, do you know this man? Do you know this man, this black man? Yeah. Martin Luther King, Martin, Martin Luther King. So uh, Martin Luther, Luther King Jr.'s day, Junior Day, honors the, uh, the famous American civil rights leader who dedicated his life to achieving equality for people of all colors or for black people in, in particular. And he was killed. They killed Martin Luther King with a bullet. But we celebrate that day. That is particular only to the US, Martin Luther King Jr. Day. Washington's birthday is only particular to the United States. Washington's birthday. Do you know who George Washington was? Yes. What well, he was the first president of the United States of yes. America. And he was born on February 22nd, 1932, here. But yes, Washington, George Washington is, was, is a very important day in the US. Another one is Independence Day. The Dominican Republic has its own Independence Day, which is on February 27th. But in the US is 4th of July. 4th of July. Very good. And they do fireworks, family reunions, concerts, barbecues, picnics, parades, baseball games, etc. And, and the light uh, of the sky. Uh, yes, yes. And another one is Columbus Day. I don't know if, if do we have a Columbus Day in the Dominican Republic? Christopher Columbus? No? I don't think so, right? I don't think so. Only in uh, only in the U.S. Christopher Columbus, and so that's another day, Christopher Columbus Day. What about this one? Do you recognize that one? Halloween. 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 Yes, Halloween. <laughs> yes, Halloween. You look, Halloween. people. So Halloween is another, now Halloween is very famous. Halloween is sometimes, even in the Dominican Republic, Halloween is sometimes celebrated by some people. Or like in the discotheques, people go with different uh, customs. It's really interesting. What about this? Thanksgiving. Yes, A Thanksgiving. Turkey. turkey, Turkey Day. The, the day of, of turkey. Yes, look at this thing, turkey. It's delicious. I love Thanksgiving. Is one of my favorite um, holidays because the food is delicious. Have you guys eaten? Have you eaten Thanksgiving? Uh, a Thanksgiving dinner? Yeah. No. I do. You have yes. Where? Here in the Dominican Republic? Nope, in the United States. In the United States, yes. I have, uh, yes, you, I have been to, in California, whenever I'm in California for Thanksgiving, I eat three, three times because I go to my father-in-law and I eat uh, Thanksgiving. I go to my mother-in-law, I eat Thanksgiving uh, dinner with them and I go to my wife's aunt and we also eat Thanksgiving. So, man, 
I'm, my belly is like this at the end of, of the trip. So much food is delicious. It's really good. All right. Now, this question to you guys. What holiday does these images remind you of? All these images that you saw. All these images. Do they, they, do they make you think about a Dominican holiday? No? Only Thanksgiving. Only Thanksgiving. All right. So, guys, let's move on to this. Um, we're going to move on to this part here um, and to do some exercises. Okay. Now, um, the practice here is as follows. As you guys have, as you have learned in the past, let me see how I can move this, get this smaller. Okay. I cannot see with this here. All right. As, as you guys know, have seen in the past, um, we're going to do with the vocabulary that you learn. Remember, target means like the objective. So the vocabulary that you learn, we're going to do some practice. Now, um, let's see if we can do some of this. Some of this. Um, Delaney, can you think of something with Thanksgiving? Can you create a sentence, say a sentence with Thanksgiving, for instance? Yeah, yeah. Um, I like Thanksgiving because we can have time with the family. Very good. Yes, that, that's that's. I do. One of the things that I also like about Thanksgiving is that in Thanksgiving you get to eat a lot of turkey, and the turkey is in other time of the years is different. It's hard to eat turkey because it's very expensive. But on Thanksgiving you eat as much turkey as you want. I like that a lot <laughs> about Thanksgiving. All right, very good. What about uh, Jezebel? Jezebel. Valentine's Day. Can you can you uh, say a sentence using the words Valentine's Day? Give uh, the present for my my husband or my or my friends. In Valentine's Day, very good. So you would say yes. In Valentine's Day, I give presents to my husband. And my friends. Very good. Yes, very good. That's good. That's good. Uh, what, what about you, Paola? Independence Day. Can you make? Can you uh, say a sentence using the words Independence Day? Yes, I am Independence Day. Go to the park. Um, dinner, barbecue, party. Very good. So in during Independence Day, or you can say on Independence Day, uh, people uh, do barbecues, uh, they party, um, they go to the park, etc. It's very good. That's good. That's good. You remember. Mr. Moore. Yes. Also in the in the Independence Day was on July 14th. Uh, on July 4th. Yes, Independence Day for the US, it's on July 4th. Yes, very good. Amaury, what about Mother's Day or Father's Day? Can you can you say a sentence using Mother's Day and Father's Day? Uh, yeah. mm -hmm. Let me, the Mother's Day. Anything, whatever comes to your mind. I don't know. Well, I, I say... Like you can... Uh -huh. Yes, go ahead. Whatever you want. Uh, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> the, the... Go ahead, Amaris. I, I, I have... Uh, I don't have idea. Like Mother's Day. Um, People celebrate Mother's Day. Uh, okay, okay. When it's the Mother's Day, uh, the, 
uh, she received a better a better gift. Yes, very uh, good. When, yes, yeah, so yes, when so you whenever you day, <laughs> okay, I'm out. So listen, and for this is for everybody. Whenever you use the word day, for example, uh, Veterans Day, Independence Day, uh, Father's Day, you need to say on. on for example, on. on Independence Day, on Mother's Day, mothers receive a lot of gifts. For example. Okay. Okay. Thank so... You. Very good. All right, so let's continue with this one. Let's do this little thing because we only have a few more minutes left. So let's do this little practice. Um, I'm going to give you an example. Let's select a holiday and complete this graphic organizer. So let's choose one of these holidays. Which one do you wanna choose? Let's choose Independence Day because we know exactly the day. Or Thanksgiving. Which one do you want to choose? Let's, let's choose Independence Day. Okay, Independence Day. Okay, so the tradition is tradition. the Independence Day. Okay, very good. What are the symbols? Well, one of the symbols Fireworks. is... Martin Luther, King. Martin Luther King. No, 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 no. Oh, Independence no. Day. For Independence Day. Ah, okay, okay. Independence. The, the Fireworks. Flag of flag. United. Yes, the flag. Ah. That is a symbol. Flag. The flag. Let's say the flag of the United States. USA. Very good. What about what date is it? Fourth of July. Fourth of July. So the date is July 4. And what about the season? What season of the year is July? It's winter, summer, spring. Summer. What summer. is it? Summer. Summer? I think it's summer. Yeah, I think it's summer, right? Right? It's summer because the atom starts in august very good so summer okay so we have the season it's summer so that's why people can go to parks because remember in winter in the u.s it's so cold you can't go to parks in winter but in summer you can go to parks you can do barbecue you can do fireworks and and all that what about the food oh sorry i i said barbecue here but actually barbecue. Oh my God. Food are barbecue. <laughs> the barbecue is here and picnic yes, yes picnics very good what and is a picnic hot dogs. Hot hot, dogs meat. yes hot dogs as well hot dogs what about what is a picnic it's a group of, of people that go that uh, they eat a lot of uh, food in a bar. Uh, yes. They're sitting in a... Like, yes. I'm going to say grama. Grass. In the grass. Okay. Yes, on the grass. On the grass. Mm -hmm. they, go to, they go to a park and see it on the grass. Very good. And eat food together, sharing. That's good, guys. That was a good one. Now... <clears throat> Let's move on. We're doing a little bit. We're going to do this part a little bit faster. But um, now we're going to listen to a dialogue. Okay. Now, what you need to do first is listen. And you, uh, you need to listen first. Open your mics and repeat. Okay. So now you listen. You listen. And then you open your mics and repeat. Okay? Do you understand? Yes? I'm going to play the video now, the, the part. So let me let me go ahead and play it here. Okay. Oops, sorry. Um, 
hyperlink. Open hyperlink, open hyperlink. All right, let me just copy this part. Copy, I'm gonna paste it here. All right, so let, let's move on to this part. Um, all righty. Let's see if we can do this hyperlink really quick. Very good, very good. All right, so. Okay, now guys, I need you to tell me if you can hear, because if you cannot hear, then it doesn't make sense. So this, it's called, this audio is an everyday conversation and it's about holiday. It's about ho uh, holiday season in the United States. Now I'm going to play the audio. Please tell me if you can hear. The holiday season in the U.S. In this conversation. Can you hear? Yes. 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 Good. Okay. So let me play it. It's, it's again, it's called holiday seasons in the U.S. Yeah. The holiday season in the U.S. In this conversation, a student, A.J., explains the different holidays he will celebrate with another student. How's the studying going, Lucia? I can't wait for finals to be over. In another week, I'll be flying back home. What are you doing over the winter break? Alan invited Lee and me to stay with his family. Home cooked food for three holiday meals. Three holidays? Alan's dad is Jewish and his mom is Christian, so they celebrate both Hanukkah and Christmas. And his mom is a professional chef, so she goes all out for both holiday meals. And what's the third holiday? New Year's Day. They have all their family over, and Alan's mom cooks again. Alan has raved about his mom's cooking all semester, so Lee and I can't wait. Holiday meals cooked by a professional chef. I want to hear all about it later. I've never had a traditional Hanukkah meal. Neither have I. I'm looking forward to it. All right. Now let's review the vocabulary. How's something going? This question is used to ask someone about his, her progress or about life in general. For example, how's the studying going means what's the progress of your studying? The general question, how's it going, is informal and similar to how are you? Can't wait means to be very eager, anxious, or impatient for something. A winter break is a period of vacation between semesters of college or other schools that includes the winter holidays, such as New Year's Day. Home cooked or homemade food means food prepared at home and not made in a factory, store, etc. Hanukkah or Hanukkah is an eight-day Jewish holiday, usually in late November or December, that commemorates the rededication of the Jewish temple in Jerusalem more than 2,000 years ago. Commemorate means to do something special to remind people of an important event or person from the past. To go all out means to put all of your energy into what you are doing or to put a lot of effort into doing something. To rave about something is to talk or write about something in an excited and enthusiastic way. A holiday meal is special food prepared and eaten for a certain holiday. Sometimes these foods are only made and eaten during a certain holiday season. For example, for many families in the U.S. on Thanksgiving, the holiday meal includes cranberry sauce. This is not a food that many people eat at other times of the year. 
Very good. Okay, so I'm going to reshare this only sharing the, the website. Did you like the audio? Did you like it? Yes. Good, good. Um, now let's, let's, as we said in the, before, let's go ahead and uh, repeat after me. So you're gonna first listen, and then you're going to repeat these words after me. Are you ready? All right, so um, the first, uh, and let's go with the harder ones because this one's you understand. Now let's remember this one, the last lesson that we had on Friday. There's a difference between can, can, and can't. Can and can't. And so here, you don't even have to pronounce it, the T, but uh, there is a difference, okay? So you, I can't wait. I can't wait. So now say it with me. Can't wait. Can't wait. Okay, everyone, remember to unlock your microphone. It's okay if we're no, noisy. Can't wait. Can't wait. Can't, can't wait. wait. Very good. Very good. Now this one. Home cooked. Home cooked. Home cooked. Home cooked. Home cooked. Home cooked. Now listen, there this ED, this ED is pronounced as a T. So home, home cooked. Home cooked. Home cooked. Home cooked. Home cooked. Very good. Home cooked. Very good. Now this one, it's a harder word. It's called Hanukkah. 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 Very good. Now this one is, all right, let me start with this here. Um, commemorates. 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 Very good. So listen again. Commemorates. Commemorates. Very good. Um, to go all out. To go all out. Go all out. Go all out. Go all out. Now listen as I say it fast. To go all out. To go, go all out. Very good. Yes. You see, that's called um, rhythm. To go all out. All right. This one, to rave. To go all out. Rave. To rave. Very good. To rave. To rave. Very good. That's how to we rave. are in English. Okay. Now this one, holiday. Holiday. Holiday, holiday meal. Holiday, Holiday meal. Meal. Holiday meal. Very good. And um, that's it, guys. Let's go back to, we have six more minutes until we're done. So let's go back to the PowerPoint presentation and conclude today. And we're going to continue tomorrow with this part, okay? So let me go back. Let me close this. The... Uh, Mr. Moon, the, the, the guy say I helped you the unit 10 and explain. Okay. Who, who, who's the guys? Everybody. Unit 10. This is unit 11. Yes. She's talking about the homework. Because oh, yes, the yes. homework. Yes, the homework. The homework. Yes, we'll the talk homework. about that. Yes, we'll talk about that tomorrow. Don't worry. Don't worry. Tomorrow we'll speak about it, okay? Okay. I'll explain tomorrow. Okay. Okay, guys. So before we're done today, um let's just go over this part so that we can tomorrow tomorrow we'll start with a role play after the prompts okay so tomorrow we're gonna do this it's gonna be a role play and we're gonna assign different people but let's finish with this information today now before the holidays let's go ahead with a maori the maori go ahead and read this part please okay before the holidays if i don't see you before have a lovely Christmas. Have a great, a great Christmas. Want you. 
Have a good one. Happy Christmas to you. Thanks. Okay, very I'll good. Continue. Yes, no, that, that's good. And now this one here, um, in English, we don't say Happy Christmas. We would say more like Merry Christmas, okay? Merry Christmas. Thanks. Yes. Have a great Christmas. All right, so that, that's good. Let's, um, can you read the second part of Maori as well? Yeah. Asking people about the, the, the plans. What are you, uh, what are you out to over Christmas? Got any plans for Christmas in New Year? Are you at home over Christmas or are you going Going away. Going away. away. Are you going away? away? Very good. Okay, guys. So um, let's stop here. There are some of these questions that I need to fix because they, it seems that they have some mistakes, but don't worry. I'll fix them and tomorrow we'll discuss this again. Okay, guys, let's stop here. Let me stop this part here. Um, the second part of the class, we'll take it tomorrow. Um, Mister, yes, you pass the list. I the role, remember. Or or call. I call call the role. Call pass the list means pass, to pass something to a person. Okay. Like this is to pass the list. So here, here you go. It's called. Call, yes, call the roll. All right, so um, I haven't done that today with you guys, but I know that Elma, Angelica, Wanda, Delaney, Mabel, Amaury, and Jezbel were here, and Paola as well. Take a photograph. No, I have a video. I'm recording it. Oh, okay. <laughs> yes. So don't worry. You're going to be present. All right, guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Have a good Bye. one. Remember to connect. See you tomorrow, two. teacher. Okay. Remember, a two. All right. See you tomorrow, Mr. Mo. See you guys tomorrow.